Some time ago I uploaded a beautiful eyeshadow tutorial while playing with my new settings on my um, new camera. Here's the tutorial. All the products will be listed in my blog um, with a step-by-step -step how to create this. But I'm using essentially a gel liner which is in a dark burgundy to create the stain on my outer eyes. I'm going to extend far beyond I need to go um, because I'm going to clean up later and get a nice sharp edge. You can leave it like this if you want to. This also creates a nice shape. So then taking a baby wipe, I'm going to go in underneath and around the edges and just clean up the outer corners just gently. Then using a gold pa uh, paint pot, I believe this is, I'm going to just place the gold with a stiffer brush um, on the out, uh, inner corner and sweeping inwards towards the middle. And I'm taking a gold by ink lot and patting that onto the gold to set. That's going to create a really nice sort of two-tone effect. And taking this cranberry colour with a softer brush this time, and I'm going to place that in the um, crease. It's a tapered brush so it will only apply colour where it really needs to be and really blend it out. Taking a deeper, darker colour, I've disappeared out camera, but I'm placing that on top of that um, dark stain. Now this is a picture of um, some crushed pigments that have just broken. I'm going to use these for the next bit. Taking a gold shimmery pigment, I'm going to apply that on top of the gold just to really make it pop. And then on a um, pencil brush, I'm taking Max Deep Purple. I'm going to place that on the outer corner over all the cranberry and I'm going to alternate between red um, pigment which is basic red by MAC and I'm going to apply that on top I'm going to blend with a soft brush and carry on until I've got the intensity and the tone of colour that I want and I'm applying a white highlighter to the eyebrow to the arch of the brow I'm going to um, do some nice Arabic thick eyeliner across the top the bottom and then put pencil in the waterline Mascara my lashes, place fake lashes on top, deepen my eyebrows. Uh, before I work on the eyebrows though, I'll do my um, foundation. Word of warning, I slap this on and that's because I want an Arabic style finish. So apply on a lot and then blend it right out. And the key is to really let this sit on the skin for a while and then gently blend in. So once I've smoothed it over and made a scary face, I'll apply a soft powder just to um, press that into the foundation, swirl it all around and make it all smooth um, and completely matte. I'm applying my corrector concealer underneath where I need it the most. With a thicker foundation you don't need the concealer so much. Um, I've applied gold highlighter underneath on the inner corner of the eye. I've disappeared for most of this or it, the camera's gone blurry, I'm still getting used to it so I do um, lose some of the pictures so you don't see all of this here. Uh, I'm still doing concealer at this point. I'm using Becca um, Rouge which is something I got in my glossy box. I'm drawing a line in my contour and then blend upwards. It's like a beautiful glossy creamy blush which blends and shears right out. And then applying a uh, black eyeshadow to connect under the eyes and just deepen it a bit more. This is when my camera started to get blurry and it just got worse from here. Um, but then you can um, see the stills which are much clearer. So these are with the false lashes on. I really hope you like the look. Thanks for waiting for me to upload. Um, please subscribe, rate and comment and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.